everyone now let us see one more question from electromagnetic induction from je mains 2025 that is question number 32 of 29th january 25 morning shift okay now the question goes like this consider i1 and i2 are the currents flowing simultaneously into nearby coils 1 and 2 respectively if l1 is equal to self inductance of coil 1 m12 mutual inductance of coil 1 with respect to coil 2 then the value of induced emf in coil 1 will be and they have given four options you have to select one from these options this is very simple a direct formula they asked nothing to do anything here now the first coil gets current that is emf is induced in the first coil because of its own self inductance and because of its own current and it will also get induced emf because of the current in the second coil and the mutual inductance between first and second coils so that we know very well that is m12 di2 by dt and because of itself is l1 di1 by dt and both are with negative sign so this is a direct formula given in ncrt book and nothing more to do as we know you can see here phi1 is equal to l1 i1 and m12 i2 so very clearly you can see so phi1 is equal to l1 i1 plus m12 i2 l1 is self inductance m12 is mutual inductance of the first coil with respect to the second coil therefore emf is equal to minus d phi 1 by dt here very clearly you have negative sign therefore negative sign will come for the whole equation minus d by dt of l1 i1 plus m1 2 i2 then l1 is a self inductance which cannot be differentiated with respect to time take it out minus l1 into di1 by dt minus m1 2 which is a constant mutual inductance of the first coil with respect to the second coil into di2 by dt so this is the answer so now if from this answer we can go back to the options and see so here what where is this option this option is in third that is that is even is equal to minus l1 di1 by dt minus m12 di2 by dt so the correct answer is option 3 thanks for watching let us meet in the next video with one more numerical till then bye god bless you all